Yeah, this is Eric from Alec Gen, and I'm standing here in front of uh, Barrier Reef in Boca Raton, Florida. We're going to be doing a series of videos to help you understand uh, the products we offer and how to correctly use them in your reef tank so you have great success. Thank you. Uh, Eric here with Alec Gen. Alec Gen is a, a live feeds company, an algal biotech company. We're located in Florida, and we're coming to you from the Barrier Reef in Boca Raton. All right, this is a place you gotta check out if you're in the neighborhood. Algen, Algen has been producing live feeds for uh, about 20 years. And we've had everything uh, from uh, jellyfish to um, whale sharks, maybe sea dragons, all different types of corals, uh, tanks, everything. We've been involved in it one way or the other, one time or the other, all right? Um, bear with me, because I'm talking about something I love. So, phytoplankton, what is phytoplankton and why do we need it? Well, first of all, phytoplankton is, is a word that comes from the Greek planktos, which means to float uh, aimlessly, and phyto is plants. So, we're talking about floating plants. I prefer to call them microalgae. Microalgae is more specific. Microalgae and phytoplankton have been around for billions of years. Cyanobacteria have been around for billions of years. And the thought behind that is that um, these critters are photosynthesizing, taking elements out of uh, the beginning Earth's toxic atmosphere and creating oxygen. So uh, phytoplankton, microalgae, have been associated with the development of our early atmosphere. Um, so we're talking about small, important, small aquatic plants and why are they important. Yeah, well, Algogen has been producing uh, microalgae and phytoplankton for about 24, 25 years. And we've been doing that primary as a food source uh, for aquaculture, for people raising uh, clams, oysters, scallops, different types of filter feeders. And then we started using the phytoplankton, the microalgae, to produce copepods, which directly feed fish and corals. So we've been doing this in an industrial capacity for a long time, and prior to uh, working at Algen, I've run all sorts of projects around the world, uh, raising phytoplankton, microalgae, hundreds of acres, uh, down to um, culture collections for universities. So Algen specializes in live phytoplankton. Live phytoplankton is very important. So this is how we package them. Yeah, that's uh, one of our, our, our reef blends, and this is copepod blend specific for feeding copepods. This is a green water, which is great as a general feed for your tank. And this is Algen Phycopyrazosanthelli, which is really important for corals, ladies and gents. The zosanthelli, your corals are not going to be as healthy. This is uh, part of the definition of the biology of corals. This is the stuff that we sell. So, phytoplankton, why is it important? Phytoplankton and microalgae, uh, they take the nutrients out of your tank, the waste nutrients like nitrates and phosphates, they take CO2 out of the air, and they make proteins and fatty acids, which get into your food chain just through this mechanism, just through phytoplankton. So phytoplankton is a great food source, but it's also a great water conditioner, so it will help make your water quality better for your fish and your corals. 